Hi, I'm Ashton Lewis, Master Brewer and Residence for the Paul Mueller Company. Today we're going to talk about the things that you need to know to size a vacuum relief valve to protect your tank from vacuum failure. When it comes to sizing your relief valve, there's certain things that you need to know. These include the hottest CIP temperature, the coldest rinse temperature, the tank volume, the tank geometry, the tank pressure rating, and the tank vacuum rating. A special condition that might be important for some breweries when sizing a vacuum relief valve is the free drain condition. Free draining can happen if a valve on the bottom of the tank is open or if a valve is accidentally removed from the bottom of the tank while full of beer. Under this scenario, the vacuum relief valve has to be much larger to accommodate the rapid escape of beer from the tank. Fermenters and bright beer tanks are an expensive part of any brewery operation and properly sizing your vacuum relief valve is a very important part of ensuring against vacuum failure. If you have any questions in the future about vacuum, vacuum relief valves or vacuum failure, call Paul Mueller Company. Thank you.